In this video, I'm going to show you how to update the Cisco iOS image path when you do a Cisco iOS upgrade or downgrade. I actually have done this in the lab, but I had some audio issue, so it's hard to replicate the thing what I have done, but I have all the commands that I have used here. So I'm going to show you very quickly what I have done. So first thing I did is I updated the image from 12.225 to 12.255. So, but I haven't, I haven't changed the image path yet. So what I did is show boot that will show you the current boot path. So the current boot path is telling me it is trying to boot to the old image, but it is not going to work after you update the new image. So if you issue a command, show flash, include bin, that's going to return what are the bin files you have in your flash. So you have only one bin file, that is 55. So it is not 25, 25 has been deleted. So you have to change the boot path, otherwise the switch won't boot. And I did a directory command and I have, this is the older path and this should be the new image and the new path. And I did a show version here, show version, and that show version will tell you what version, uh, you have right now because I haven't rebooted the switch after did the image upgrade. So it's showing me the old image version. And then I go here, uh, DIR flash to uh, get everything here so I can copy and paste. And then what I did is uh, boot system switch, put a question mark here, that gives you the option of one to nine. So you can define what switch you want to change this variable. Right now I have a single switch, so I, have, I can define it as one. But if you have a stack, you can put that to all. So it will be set to all switch in the stack. So I'm going to define, this is the command I'm going to issue. And what I did is I include a flash that should not be the case. I should use this command. Boot system switch one and image. And then after that, I issue a command here. Uh, okay, so I issued a command show boot and it's showing me the new boot image, right? And then what I have done is I did a write mem, and then I reloaded the switch, reload, switch, reload. And then what I have done is after reloaded, so if you see here when it reload, it reload from the new image, right? After it reloaded, and I came here, I did a command show version, yeah, yeah, so it's it's came up to this one. And then I did an enable command and then I did a show version and that gave me this new image. So let me do that again, show version. You do the show version, it's going to give you the new image. And you show boot, and it is it is giving you the new path. Boot path list is, this is the one. I uh, hope uh, this video is helpful for you. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any question, uh, please do ask them in the comment section. I will um, reply to all of your questions. 
also turn on your notification so you will get notified when I release a new video. All right, thanks, bye.